This next one, I absolutely love it. Hello, everybody, and welcome back to The Misty Show. Thank you guys so much for coming back today. I have got a mega Timu haul. Thank you so much to Timu for sponsoring today's video. Um, everything that I have purchased, I will put the links down in the description. If it's something that you might be interested in purchasing, this is going to be an honest review. I've got some jewelry, I've got some shoes, I've got some clothes. This is gonna be a try on haul. Um, at the end of the video, I will change my clothes, we'll try on the outfits, and I will give you in my honest opinion on each item. So if you are curious about Timu or you would like to place an order with Timu, I do have a link down in the description where you can save some money on your first order. So check out the description down below for the link. Use my code in order to save money on your first order. So without any further ado, let's go ahead and get into this big bag. All right. I sliced the bag open, but we're going to pull out the first item. Now, I got really raked over the coals in one of my other Timu hauls because they were like, you're an idiot. Why are you ripping open the bag? So we're going to pay attention and we are going to unzip the bags so we can reuse them for something else. So I'm unzipping the bag. All right, the first item we have is a kimono. Oh, I love these. See, I have a kimono on now. I will be doing this as a try on, but I will put right there in the corner a picture of the listing. Now, sometimes some of these things are not currently available. So if you're clicking on the link or you're trying to find it, some things may not be available because Timu does run out of stock. They do what they will recommend some similar items. But I love a kimono to wear in layers. Um, I am a plus size woman and I like, I don't like things to be form fitting. So I do like a layered look. And these kimonos and short sleeves are great because they allow you to do that. I moved back the camera a little bit because I thought I was a little too close. But we'll see. All right, the next item, huh? zipper. Pocket. Now, I've been wanting to try these. I'm a Birkenstock girl. I love my Birkenstocks. Now, these are a dupe of the Birkenstock. I don't know. Are they the Arizonas? They're the rubber ones, basically. I actually, I have many colors, and I actually have to get black ones every year because I wear them out. But these feel like the real deal. They're not. They're not Birkenstocks, but they feel just like it. So, these I will be trying on as well when we get to the end of the video. I know that they did several different colors. The ones I got are these, like a bubblegum pink. They don't have a big platform. These are the most comfortable shoes. We'll see if these, you know, fit the bill as well to be on par, you know, as Birkenstocks. Oh, another pair of shoes. I think these are kind of a dupe of a Teva uh, sandal. Oh yeah, these are STQ, but they are, let me get them like that, uh, really pretty. This is like a Tivu, Teva, Teva. That's the word I'm looking for, a Teva um, brand, but they feel a lot like it. So we'll try these on as well. And these are a kind of a pink and purple and blue design there. Those are going to be great. Okay, let's pull out. I think this is a dress. Look, I'm being a good girl. I'm not ripping open the bag. This is a dress in this army green. A little short sleeved number there. You're not going to be able to see a full view at the moment. But I will do put in the little graphic there and I will be giving this a try on. 3XL. So I did size up. There are, uh, there are measurements in each article of clothing that you're looking for on the site. I don't really, <laughs> I've not measured myself, so I don't really go by that. I probably should. I just tend to just go with a gut instinct. Sometimes it works and sometimes it doesn't. But Timu does have a great 
uh, customer service and they do this the, the returns are very very easy you get your money really quickly so I don't ever have any qualms about returning something if it doesn't fit this next piece is a uh, this is also a 3xl it's kind of that polyester-esque material that I'm not real crazy about but it is also a cute little sundress um, so we will give this a try on as well. But I like the colors that are in that. Very, very cute for summer. And I think it might be a good length that you can wear as a dress itself or even as a bathing suit cover up. But you could also wear it with some leggings underneath it as well. All right. So now we've got headbands. Oh, I love, love Timu's jewelry and their accessories and their headbands. And this one's in a cheetah theme. <sighs> cheetah. All right. So let's, I got the, oh, I got my space buns in also from Timu. So let's put this headband in. Let's move this camera up a little bit there. There we go. I do like it. It looks a little weird with the space buns, but I love me a Timu headband what's going on there I don't know that's like sticking up there so I'm not so sure about that I don't know if that's supposed to be part of the bow I don't know jury's still out on this one because I don't really want a horn I'm not trying to be a unicorn but I'm not sure what that is all about so I don't know not sure yet about this one jury jury is still out on the headband I've done completely did a wackadoo to my hair. But I have a feeling that there's more hair products in here that I'll be having to take my space buns out for. Oh, we got a box. These are all things that I myself picked out and I ordered. Let's see what this is. Oh, these are fun. All right, I like weird things. This is pretty weird. I have to say, I thought it was a little bit bigger than what it is. But it's a little small. It's a little vase, a little head vase. You can put some greenery in there. Look at this little butt. I did think that it was a little bit bigger than this, but this is still really, really cute. Put a little air plant in there. It does have a little drainage hole there on the bottom, so that's nice. But I don't know if I, there was a couple different versions of these. I don't know. I can't remember if I've got a different version or not, but that's fun and weird. He's just a head, butt, knees, and feet. That could be a song. Head, butt, knees, and feet, knees, and feet. This I'm going to put on my bookshelf. Hello, Johnny. He's from The Shining. It's Jack Nicholson. And it, here comes Johnny. <laughs> But you put books on each side and it looks like he's bursting out. That's at least what they um, they showed in the picture that sucked me in. Made me want to purchase this. Weird. You know, look at these two little weirdos. That's fun. You know you want people to come to your house and be like, who the hell? Yeah, that's what I like. That's charming to me. All right. Oh, I'm so glad that I got this because I... <laughs> I honestly really needed another one. And if this one, oh, that was in there too. That shouldn't have been in there, but it was. If this works out well, I'm gonna order another one. It's a ring light. I'm always in need of a more light. If you film YouTube content or TikTok or whatever it is that you're filming, got a little hair that's going away from me. You always need a ring light in multiple different places in multiple different locations. I myself have to bring them back and forth if I'm filming content at my house. Back and forth, back and forth. So it's good to have extras. This one does come with a tripod, which just the extra tripod alone is a great deal. This part goes up. Well, it has all these components. I'm not going to mess with putting them all together. We've got the ring light. We've got the tripod. We've got the little phone stand holder. It, it does. It is USB. So you can plug it directly into your computer or you can put it onto a brick. And we do have the controls to make it brighter, uh, soft, light, soft light. But this is pretty much just like some of the other ones that I've ordered from other places. So this is going to come in very handy. And honestly, I may order me another one. This was also inside. 
I'm not quite sure. I know that I ordered these, but I don't know why that they were inside the ring light box. But they are these little, they're almost like a mouse pad. But these are cow, um, and they go in, well, cow pattern. They go in the cup holders in your car. I got these for my daughter. She loves cows. So I got those for her. This is the unfortunate part about Timu is that you get things sent to you in a bag and sometimes they get a little smushed. This is a little mushroom that might be, I don't know if, are you broken mushroom? No, you're not broken, but it's a little nightlight. It's a little mushroom nightlight. See, you can't really tell from there. And there's Bugs Life on that side. I'm not quite sure why, but it is an LED little nightlight. Isn't that cute? All right, we've got some florals. Um, in my last unboxing, I got a lot of floral bouquets. And you have to really fluff them up. But if you're buying any florals from Dollar Tree or Michael's or Joann's, you also have to fluff those up as well. But those are really pretty pink flowers. And I like to use them in displays and um, really an inexpensive Way to add a little bit of color to your display. Okay, we got some stickers. Now, some of you may already know this, but I am a full-time vintage and antique reseller. If you're not following me on my main page, please, or my main YouTube channel, Dr. Junker Vintage Hunter, please go and give me a follow. But I, in my packaging, when I'm selling items, I do include little um, package toppers. And these are little stickers that are, thank you for your order. So the little cards that you can put in to your packaging. Oh, happy day. Or put them on the outside of your box. 55 pieces. And they were like a couple dollars. So I, and everything I will put on the screen, how much I paid for the items. So those are going to be great for package choppers. And I probably have, yeah, these are also for package choppers too. Um, Timo is a great place to buy items for package toppers or even shipping supplies and that sort of thing too. I've gotten the bubble mailers from there before and they've been wonderful. So these are just little business cards that say thank you so much. They're all the same design. They're blank on the back so you can write a little note on the back of them if you would like. So it's just a little added something to your packages. Here is another thing that I'm using as package toppers. Stress less cards. And let me get these open so we can take a little peek at them. Again, it's just something that you add, you know, to the pack, to the topper of your package. And, you know, sometimes if you're giving some people like an encouragement card, maybe that's just what they needed to read that day. I'm always, that's just kind of what I always think. I always think that maybe, you know, through some sort of serendipitous way, that the item that I'm sending in the package is maybe a little something that that person needed to see. So we've got these stress less cards. So this is the first side. And then it tells you different things that you can do to help relieve stress. Say you're great. And it says, write down a list of things you like about yourself and stuff you excel at. Use a moment to notice all of the great things you are. You can do the list when the, with the help of this question. If you were someone else, what things would you envy? Hmm. Whenever, when you pay attention to the good things in yourself, you don't just make them stronger, but also feel more complete and more powerful. If you only pay attention to the things you lack, you will feel incomplete, unsatisfied, which, at, which adds to the feeling of stress. That is so true. So I think that these would be great. Oh, I've been, okay, this is a, look, look at me. I'm not ripping open the bags. I'm using them at their opener. This is fake hair. So I've bought headbands from Timu before. These, these are going to be different because <laughs> I'm going to have to take out my space buns. But maybe not. Timu, space buns, they're great. They match well. So th this is a headband with, This, this is my never cut bangs, Misty. They're kind of long, but this is what I would look like with bangs. 
That That's not a good look. Not a fan of the bangs. Maybe if they were trimmed a little bit, because they're a little long. Yeah, this, okay, I'm gonna go on record right now and say that I will never cut bangs, never. But, you know, if I don't like the bangs, I can just kind of cut the whole thing off. <laughs> I'm not gonna return it, but I'll use that headband. Whew, okay. I'm gonna put myself together a little bit, put my space buns back in. But that, that was just a definite no, no bangs for Misty. Here we go, poop. And, oh, that one's a little higher. There we go, easy peasy. These are great, highly recommend the space buns. All right, oh, we got some more package toppers. You guys are like, oh, we don't care about the package toppers, but I ordered them and I'm gonna show them. These are, you get, it just says peach on here, but they are little, um, I don't know, just just like little cards. They come in this like little notebook and you can peel them off. Rabbit, rabbit's happiness. Life is impossible. Sometimes the translations are a little off. Um, on my own, life is like a river. And then it says that. Boo, you. That's not a nice word. I'm not so sure about these. Fruit species. Oh, that one's an innocent one. Dream with the carousel. Well, some of these will have to be not used because I'm certain I'm not going to send one of my customers, one that has that word on it. No. Okay, well that's interesting. This is a miniature. These are adorable. It is a little miniature and I love miniatures. Tiny treasures. This is a, I don't know what that is, but look, they're little butter cookies. It's a little butter cookie tin. It's a little metal tin. They've got these little felt discs that I think are supposed to like be like plates. But on the inside are all the little butter cookies. Look at the little pretzels in there. Oh, those are adorable. I think it has this so you can, you can stick it on something and it won't move. Now that is cute. Oops. It's a little miniature if you have a dollhouse. You can set the little cookies up on a plate. I'm not gonna do that because they'll all fall over. That's cute. Oh, we got a brush. This is a happy brush. I love this brush. Look, it's a Care Bear brush. It is the good hair bear. It's actually a cheer bear, but it's a nice fun brush with the Care Bear on it. So the cover of it here is like a little rubbery Care Bear. That is so cute. So cute. And it's this nice uh, bristled brush. Works really nice. It's a good like brush to get your tangles out. Yay. That's good. I like that a lot. Oh, these are fun. These are earrings. They're Pac-Man earrings. So we've got the Blue Ghost. They're a little plastic. We got the blue ghost. We got the orange. Actually, they're mon they're pa and Pac-Man. They're really supposed to be called monsters, but we just call them ghosts. We got the red ones. We got pink ones. And we've got the star of the show, Pac-Man. These would be really cute if one had a bow. So one was Mr. Pac-Man and one was Mrs. Pac-Man. They're very lightweight. So fun and colorful. And you could wear one orange and one red. Or for the 4th of July, a blue and a red. You could wear Pac-Man. You could switch it up and wear different ones. Those are adorable. Yes, yes, yes. I really like those. And you get all of them. I got the whole set for one money. You can see right there what I paid for it. Those are fun. Like those. All right, these are, I think I got several different uh, ones. They are the nail stickers. And um, I went through a phase where I wanted my nails to breathe and I wasn't getting my nails done at the salon. But as you can see, 
that didn't last very long. So I will probably give these to um, either as package toppers or I'll give them to my daughter for her nails because I, you know, I, I gave in and I'm going to the salon now. All right, here's some more earrings. Oh, I love these. <gasps> these are a plastic earring with the gold confetti stars. Aren't those fun? I really like their earrings. Their jewelry in general is just fabulous. Very inexpensive. Such fun things. So you feel like you can, you know, you can try different things, different ones. I got actually got two of those because I got one for a friend of mine. So I'm giving those to her. Fun. All right, here is a necklace. I have not been disappointed with the jewelry. So this one's a, on a little bit of a longer chain. It's a gold tone with an M on it for Misty. That's me. So I love that. Yes, 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 yes. Love Timu's jewelry. Love it. All right, here is another set of earrings. Oh, these are fun too. They're, they're kind of reminiscent of the ones that I have in. These are just white, very groovy white plastic florals in the dangle. Love those. I love the jewelry. Oh, here is a ring. I have this same ring in the silver tone. Just a simple little heart. I'll take my current ring off to try that one on. So you can see there, it's a fun, just a very simple little gold heart. I love the silver one. I wear it a lot. So I thought, well, I'm going to go ahead and get one in, in a gold tone as well. So that's a winner. I love that. I was surprised at these. Oh my gosh, I have a lot of jewelry in here. I was surprised at these bracelets here because I love Perveda bra bracelets. Um, I have several of them. These are Perveda bracelets and they feel like, I mean, they feel just like the other ones. I don't know if they're authentic. They are one size and so you uh, control the length with this, and this one is just pastel colors. The way that I usually put them on is like that. You kind of need someone to help you put them on. I can't do it alone. I Well, I can, but I gotta use my teeth. And this is another one too. I don't like to layer them. This one just has a lot of different colors on them. And typically, I'll keep them on for a couple days. And they're big enough, too, where you can put it around your ankle. There we go. To use as an anklet. I don't, I have not done that, but I know a lot of people that do. But I like to, to layer them. So I was kind of surprised when I saw those. I wanted to give them a try. All right. Oh, I love this. So, and this is the month of June. So we are celebrating Pride. And I saw that Timu had a couple of these bracelets. So love is love, pride, and we've got the rainbow here, beads. Wear this jewelry with pride. Don't ever be afraid to show off your true colors. So I like that a lot. So this one is very much kind of the same deal as the ones that I just put on. We've got that bracelet on as well, and I can give that one to somebody else. Yay. All right. More jewelry. So we've got a little silver tone necklace in here. I do have more clothes in here too. And we have a whole other bag. So this is a, this is a haul. This one is a, just a simple little silver toned heart necklace with just one little, one little silver heart on it. That one is really cute. I wonder to say I might've ordered the gold tone one as well. I'm not sure. So we've got a couple more rings. I'm gonna take my, my current ring off again so we can try these on. I think this next one is a layered ring. Yeah, oh, this is cute. It's a layered ring. So we've got the gold and the silver. Let's see, how do we put this together? These do, you can uh, spread them apart to size them. Nope, doesn't go on that way. Hey, I'm not quite sure because it kind of looks like that heart has bunny ears. I'm not quite sure how these are supposed to be layered. 
you can see in the picture what it, it's supposed to look like, but I can't figure that out. So, I don't know. I don't know about that ring. I ordered some of these before. I wear a size 6 in rings, and the other the ones that I bought, yeah, this is the same. Way too big, but it has sort of an amethyst, amethyst stone in there. It's a size 6, and it's 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 too big, and it, but it's too small for my middle finger. So, it's too big. It's too big. So, it's a very pretty ring with this uh, stone on it, but... That one's also going to have to go back because it does not fit. So that's unfortunate. But, you know, the return policy is very, very easy. Oh, look, guys, it's more stickers. I know you can't wait, right? You can't wait. These are, you get 50 stickers. And they are, what is this? It's two little sheep. When it's hard to find kindness, I will make it myself. I think these are just like inspirational stickers. Okay, that's enough today. That's enough today for me. I'll just be a burrito over here, thanks. It's a little cat burrito. So they're just a little encouraging. I may be a mess, but I'm doing my best. Little encouraging stickers there, great. As package toppers, again, sometimes, maybe that's just what somebody needed. Like, they're like, yeah, that's a good idea. I'll go be a burrito. Oh, we got lots more package choppers in here, which is good for me because I really needed some more. So these are, you get 72 cards. And again, I think that they are inspirational cards that I wanted to use for my packages. Or you can stick it in a card. If you send cards to people, you make a difference in so many ways. Now these aren't stickers. They are just like a little business card. I'm in all of your many talents. You are a superstar. So just a little fun. Having you around makes all the difference in the world. I think that these are great, great little cards to tuck in your packages. If you are selling items on eBay, Poshmark, wherever, or if you just want to, you know, you could do like a little random acts of kindness and just kind of leave those around in odd places, you know, post office, the grocery store shelves, maybe, you know, just so somebody can see a little encouragement. Oh no, this is another one of those little book stickers. Beautiful castle. I want to, wait, I want to with you moon. Um, I don't understand that. Color of summer, color of summer, color of summer, color of summer. I'm not so sure about these. Welcome to my world. Wisdom is better than darkness with a dinosaur. Okay, so there's a couple little encouragement encouragement things. I don't know about some of these. No rotten. Please don't let go of your dream quietly. Sooner or later, it will shine in your hands. I don't understand. But anyway, there is that. That's kind of on the same lines as the other one. Not so sure about that one. All right, here is a clothing item. This one is in a size 4X. Sometimes you have to order the clothes in a little bit bigger of a, of, of a size. Ooh, this one's like a Day of the Dead with a candy skull there. This one's long sleeve. Nice and colorful, so we'll give that one a try on. Ooh, here's another article of clothing. Ooh, this one's a tube top. This one, ooh, it's a little short, though. I'm not sure about this one already, but we'll try it on. Um, it's a very, it's a little short. You have to wear a shirt. Well, I will have to wear a shirt underneath it or over it. So a little uh, tube top action going on there. We'll give that a try. Here is another article of clothing. Keeping all of the bags just in case. Oh, good. Another kimono. I love, I love a layered look. And these are, um, you know, you see a lot of them at long sleeve uh, for winter, but these are short sleeve. So this will look good with a black shirt and black leggings. So that's a little sheer kimono. I like that already. All right. So this one is, well, we don't know, but it's in a box. 
Oh my gosh. Okay. I love Star Wars and I love Grogu. There's a little Grogu. He's an angry. Ah, no, way. I guess when you look at him real close, he doesn't look as angry. Oh, you got a little styrofoam on your ear, Grogu. But you can put a little air, a little air plant in here. Again, pay attention to the measurements because they're the measurements are there. I don't pay attention to the measurements, and I thought he was a little bit bigger than what he is, but he's kind of small. But you put a little air plant in there or a faux air plant in there, and he will hold your your little flower there. No squeezy. No squeezy. Oh, he's so cute. Love that. Oh, these are cute. Oh, okay. I thought that they were stained glass. They are not. But it is a little faux succulent. Let me get it out of the package. So it is a plastic. I thought it was stained glass. It's clearly not. Um, so you can put this in a little pot. And it looks like you've got like a little rainbow succulent in there. I don't know. Thought it was stained like actual stain or even like a translucent plastic. Not so sure about this one. I will I will stick it in a little pot and see. But we're gonna set this aside as as a I don't know. Again, I thought this was stained glass or some sort of translucent plastic, and it's not. But this is a little hanger. I don't know. Maybe once we put it in the window, we'll see if you can if it some light does go through it. But I thought it was really cute with the mushrooms, kind of going along with the little mushroom nightlight there. But we'll see. Maybe with some natural light through it, it'll mimic um, a stained glass. So we will see. And then the last item in this bag, and then we have a whole other bag to do. Make sure we got it all out. We did. Oh, we've got some more um, nail stickers. Let me know in the comments, have you tried the nail stickers? I, I've used the Color Street nail stickers before and have had really good luck with them. These are a whole pack of them with a little emery board. So let me know in the comments if you've used the nail stickers on Timu and if you liked them. This is another one of those little necklaces. You know, I got the heart one in silver tone. But this one is in gold tone, and it is a little gold, a little gold star. So very cute. It has an adjustable clasp, so you can, you know, make it different lengths if you wanted it to be more of like a choker size. All right, and the last item in that particular bag is in this box. Let's see what it is. Okay. Okay. So it is the larger size succulent. Um, again, I thought it would, it would be a little translucent. So this one can go into a bigger pot and then you can pair it with the smaller one to go into a smaller pot. I mean, I'm going to give them a try um, before I, you know, say yay or nay. But um, yeah, that was that was the first box. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to do a try on with these current ones. I'm going to save the second bag as a separate video. So make sure that you are subscribed to watch me open the second bag. But we're going to give me a moment and we're going to switch gears. I'm going to try on the shoes. I'm going to try on the clothes for the clothing try on session. All right, this first dress unfortunately is going to have to get sent back. It is just way too big. This one is in a 4X and I'm in a typically a 1X, 2X, 14, 16 size. So this one is really too big and that's so unfortunate because I love I love the sugar skulls on it and the cactus and the florals. Not a big fan of a bell sleeve. So unfortunately, this one is going to have to get returned, but the returns are very, very easy. So I'm just gonna return this one for a smaller size, but it's nice and flowy. Really like that about it and just gonna have to order it in a smaller size. All right, this next one, I absolutely love it. Let me show you. Look at how cute this is. Guys, I'm still playing around with getting an appropriate way to show these clothes to you. Um, but I love this one. I left on my black leggings. 
I really like the look of it, but honestly, it is a, a right above the knees, so it's a great length if you didn't want to wear leggings, you know, underneath it. You absolutely didn't, wouldn't have to, but I really like it. It's nice and flowy. This one, um, like I said, I am a, in a 14, 16. I did get this one in a 3X, and it fits perfectly. It is a V-neck. I like the way that it's cut. It's got these beautiful, vibrant colors on them. This one, I think I'm probably just gonna wear this one for the rest of the day. I am, I really, really like it. Oh, let me show you the shoes. So I do have on the uh, Tiva dupes. They're really, really comfortable. I like the color on them. Definitely a keeper. They look great with the leggings. They're nice and sporty, so you can wear them, you know, with, with just uh, your athletic wear, if you're just running to the, to the mailbox, running to the store. But they also look great with a little dress on, too. So thumbs up for both the shoes and this dress. Definitely going to keep this one. All right, here is the um, army green dress. It's a little wrinkly. That's just how it came to me in the mail, so it will need steamed. It is just um, right at mid-calf, which is nice. I like that it has this little elastic around the waist, so it kind of cinches in your waist a little bit. I think that a, a belt would be really, really cute with this as well. I like the little faux buttons and the little ruffle around the collar and the sleeve. So this one's definitely, this will be a great dress to wear to a summer wedding or on a date night. It's very flowy. So this one's another keeper, but just keep in mind that with this dress in particular, you are going to need to go up. If you are in a, in a 14, 16, you're going to need to go up to a, uh, probably 4X. I really like it. It's a keeper. I promise you I have clothes on, <laughs> but this little number here is the halter. And I got this with full intention of wearing another item over it, like a little denim jacket or a, another, um, what's the word, I'm, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Another shrug or something over it. It's a little short, but I do, I do still like it, but forewarning, I don't like my arms and I'm going to, listen, I'm going to embrace the fact that I have big arms and I'm not going to hide it up for this video. So I'm going to embrace it. It's summer and it's hot. And sometimes we don't want to wear a lot of layers, but this one I probably will, but I'm going to go ahead and show you the fit in this video. Here we are. So we've got the halter top. It is really, really cute. I have to say, um, you would need to wear a strapless bra with it. I just kind of tucked my, uh, bra straps down in the shirt just for the sake of this video. Um, I was worried about the length, but honestly it does kind of cover up the little poochy area. But um, I would definitely wear a denim shrug or something over it. But I think it's a nice, sassy shirt. Great for summer. But if you're subconscious of your arms, like me, yeah, we want to cover them up a little bit. But I did want to show you the length of it. This one is, oh gosh, I can't remember. I'll put it up in the description, the size that this one is. Pro I think that this one's pretty pretty true to size because we have a lot of stretch there. But if you wanted something a little bit longer, this may not be the pick for you, but I'm going to keep it. I like it. And I think it'll be great with a little, a little something over it in the summertime. But you could, you could also wear this as a cover up too for the beach if you wanted to. So I like it. I'm going to keep it. All right. Here is the first little shrug uh, that I got. This one is kind of has an angled to the side there which I like. It's very sheer, so it will keep you cool on a hot summer day, but I like it. Definitely going to keep it. It's sort of like a little tie-dye number, and I can't remember if this is a one size fits all, but I will put the size that I ordered up there. Again, I am a 14, 16, size 1X, sometimes 2X depending, um, but I do like that, and I also wanted to show you the shoes. You can see here, these are the dupes of the uh, Birkenstocks. They are like a rubber shoe. I gotta take that sticker off right there, but like the rubber shoe, and honestly, these are a little bit more comfortable <laughs> than the Birkenstocks. They're nice and cushiony. They do have an arch in them, so that is nice. They come in a lot of different colors, so I'm probably gonna order some more in some different colors of these, but shrug number one is a keeper. 
All right, we got one more item of clothing to try on. Guys, this one might be my favorite. I like it a lot. It is the kimono. That was the word I was looking for earlier, kimono. Um, I love the cut of this. It's nice and flowy. We've got the high cut right there. This would also be one that would be great for a swimsuit cover-up as well. Nice and sheer and flowy. I love it with a pair of leggings, but it would also look cute with some shorts as well. So like some shorty shorts, and then you've got this kimono to kind of give you a little bit of uh, coverage if you would like, but this is great. I love the collars. Love it. So this one is definitely, I give you two thumbs up, but I got my, my phone in my other hand. I really like this one a lot. Well guys, that was that was the haul. I want to thank Timu for sponsoring today's video. Guys, don't forget down in the description there is a coupon code where you can save money on your first Timu order. Look at the measurements. Every article of clothing does have some measurements on that, so if you want to take some of your measurements, but the return policy is very easy if things don't work out. I, I love it. I love this kimono and I love the dresses, so thumbs up for the clothing try on. I like the shoes, I like the jewelry. Just a couple things that I'm probably gonna be returning that aren't gonna work for me. But um, thank you guys so much for watching the video. Don't forget to check out the code in the description. I'm getting ready to film part two, so get ready for part two. That one's gonna be coming up very soon. Again, thanks to Timu. And don't forget to subscribe to The Misty Show if you like this sort of content. A lot of content for plus size women over 40 or just for anybody that likes, you know, unboxings and, and likes to laugh and giggle and be kid like. I hope that you will join and subscribe to the channel. Make sure that you give this video a thumbs up. Leave me a comment and let me know which one of the outfits was your favorite. Which one did you like the most? I'm always curious to hear your thoughts on this. So thank you guys so much for watching this video and I will see you in the next one. Bye guys.